Hey, it's Larry, and today I'm going to do a quick review of the Celestron Nextart GPS. This is a 9.25 inch or 2,350. It's an F10 SCT, Schmidt Cassegrain telescope. Um, and these were released um, at the beginning of the 2000s, I think from like 2000 one or two this the 9.25 didn't come out until 2003 and i think only until 2007 um, or 8 and then they replaced it with the cpc um, these are known for having the carbon fiber tube um, this has the uh, starbright coating and uh, i think the last year got the starbright xlt i can't tell the difference i have both um, but the starbright's important uh this one is special because it's got the bob knobs it's got like the starzona um weight and balance system on it for astrophotography and then the uh fine focuser these are it's like a 400 dollars upgrade alone um the thing about these was that the uh the tube's great they're they haven't changed much um except for the coating um but the control on these the original ones uh, had a rollover issue, so the GPS stopped working on them. So you have to either update to the newer controller, um, which is what I did, um, or if you got like the last year, they had like the four point something and you could upgrade that one. But um, the GPS generally don't work on these anymore um, because of the rollover issue. Great scope. This one tracks fantastically. I think the gears inside have been upgraded um, before I bought it. Um, so it's, if you, if you hear it, it's just, it's quiet. You can barely hear it. It's super smooth and it tracks really well. So I think the um, motor controller and the gears were upgraded for astrophotography. Because um, uh, usually they're a little louder, the, uh, the CPC model. Um, that's about it. This thing is great. I, use, I don't do astrophotography anymore. So I only use this for visual and it's fantastic. It works just the same as my... Um, at Evo 9.25, which is what I have now. Um, the biggest headache with these is moving them. Um, because they're all one unit with the um, mount, um, it's easy It's easy to set up, but it's heavy. So you have a handle under here, and you have another handle here, and you got to grab it. I think it's 45 to 50 pounds, as long as you don't have anything on it. Um, and then you have to throw it in the case. Um, and then you have to pick it up and toss it on here. So this one's been upgraded. It's got the Starzona, Starzona um, plate and the, what's called the landing pad. And that helps you um, line it up really quick. So it's only two things to set up. It's a tripod, which you have to level. And then you put this on top and then just put the screws in. So it sets up quickly. So I, I really liked it, but uh, I already have the uh, Evo version. So I'm going to sell it. Anyway, thanks for watching.